Prince Harry furious as princess and declares him a commoner. Should he never return to the royal family? He's not royalty anymore. Princess Anne's words shook the royal world. She said Prince Harry is a commoner. This statement shook the world, not just because of who said it, but because of who it was about. Harry, once a beloved royal, was called an outsider by his aunt. But how did we get here? What caused such a big change in the royal family? And what does this mean for Harry's future? Stay with me as we unravel the royal drama that's got the entire world buzzing. Hashtag 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 the royal rift. A timeline of tension. Prince Harry was once a beloved royal. His cheeky smile and rebellious nature made him stand out. But things changed when Harry and Meghan Markle decided to step back from royal duties in 2020. Then came the interviews. Harry and Meghan's talk with Oprah in 2021 revealed shocking truths. They talked about racism, neglect, and emotional isolation, showing a family divided. Many wondered if this rift could ever heal. Enter Princess Anne. Known for her traditional views and loyalty to the monarchy, she speaks her mind. Her statement that Harry is a commoner added to the drama. But why did she say this? What does it mean for Harry's place in the royal family? Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag the role of tradition. Why the monarchy values hierarchy. The British royal family values tradition deeply. Every action is guided by centuries of customs and rules. These traditions define what it means to be part of the monarchy. Princess and believes in these values deeply and is known for her hard work and dedication to royal duties. She's often called the most royal of all royals, despite being lower in line of succession. Her statement about Harry was a reflection of her belief in duty, protocol, and hierarchy. But does this matter in today's world? Should bloodlines and titles still be important, given Harry and Meghan's push for a more progressive future? This question divides people, sparking curiosity about how royal institutions adapt to change. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag the fallout. What does it mean to be a commoner? Princess Anne's statement about Harry wasn't just a personal attack. It had deep implications about royalty. For centuries, being royal was tied to birthright. Did Harry lose his birthright by stepping back from royal duties? This question is central to the royal rift. By calling him a commoner, princess, and stripped Harry of his royal identity. For someone like Harry, who grew up with titles and prestige, being called a commoner is an identity crisis. But what does it mean to be a commoner? In the royal context, it means Harry is like everyone else, no longer bound by royal life's privileges or burdens. Some see this as liberating, while others value tradition and see it as a fall from grace. Imagine waking up one day and realizing the world no longer sees you as a prince. That's what Harry is now facing. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag the emotional toll. Harry's journey from royal to outsider. Harry's decision to leave the royal family has taken a toll on him. He's talked about his mental health and feeling isolated. But being called a commoner by princess and hurts more than any criticism. Stepping back from royal duties is hard. But having your family turn against you is even harder. Harry feels rejected by the institution that defined his life. Titles are everything in the world. Losing your royal identity feels like losing a part of yourself. But Harry is different. He's always followed his own path. He's determined to create his own life, even if it means leaving the royal family. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag a modern dilemma. Can you ever really leave the royal family? Can Harry ever truly leave the royal family? Even though he stepped back, can he escape the public's fascination with his royal background? Harry will always be seen as a prince, no matter what. The public has followed his life from birth. He's royalty to them, and there's no escaping that, but the dilemma is real. Harry wants to live a new life, away from the monarchy's spotlight. Yet, every interview and public appearance brings back his royal past. So, can you ever truly leave the royal family, or does it follow you forever? Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag Princess Anne's intentions. A family divided. Princess Anne's comments may seem harsh, but she sees Harry's decision as a rejection of the monarchy. She's dedicated her life to the crown and feels betrayed. Is Princess Anne right? Or is Harry just trying to protect his mental health and happiness? This question has divided the royal family and the public. Some see Harry as a hero for breaking free. Others view him as a deserter. 
Princess Anne's words have only added to the controversy. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag moving forward. What's next for Prince Harry? Despite the drama, Prince Harry is moving forward. He's focused on his family, charity work, and building a life free from royal protocol. But can he ever truly escape the royal shadow? Only time will tell. But one thing's for sure, Prince Harry is no longer the boy we watched grow up in the palace. He's a man determined to live life on his own terms, royal or not. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag conclusion. A royal family divided. The royal family faces modern challenges, and the world watches. The drama and intrigue keep people fascinated by the British monarchy. At the heart of it all is a family torn between tradition and progress. They are caught between loyalty and independence. As Harry steps away from his royal roots, the question is, can he ever truly leave the monarchy behind? Or will tradition always pull him back? This story continues to unfold with no clear end in sight. But one thing is certain, Prince Harry's journey is far from over. Call to action. What do you think? Should Prince Harry return to the royal family? Or is he better off on his own? Share your thoughts in the comments, and let's keep the conversation going. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag the public's opinion. Divided loyalty. This royal drama is a spectacle for the world to watch and weigh in on. Public opinion on Prince Harry is sharply divided. Everyone seems to have an opinion. Some see Harry as a hero for leaving the royal family. They believe he took control of his life and chose mental health over duty. For them, Harry represents a modern figure, breaking from tradition. Others view the royal family as essential to British culture. They believe duty to the crown should come first. To them, Harry's decision feels like a betrayal of the family and the country. These views fuel heated debates online and in tabloids. Whether you're Team Harry or Team Tradition, it's hard not to be emotionally invested in this saga. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag the power of story. Why we can't look away. Why do we care so much? It's not like we'll ever meet Prince Harry, yet we're captivated by his story. The British royal family is legendary, and when royals go rogue, it feels like a modern-day Shakespearean drama. This isn't just a royal story, it's a human story. It's about family, identity, and the struggle between duty and desire. We've all experienced this conflict in our own lives, even if the stakes aren't as high. And in Harry, we see a reflection of our own struggles. He's torn between loyalty to his family and protecting his mental health. He wants to honor his roots, but also build a new life on his own terms. It's a narrative that resonates with anyone who's ever felt the pressure of tradition and the yearning for freedom. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag lessons from the royals. How to navigate your own family drama. Family conflicts are a universal experience. You don't have to be born into royalty to know the pain of disagreements and the struggle to balance personal freedom with family obligation. So, what can we learn from the royal family's challenges that might help us navigate our own? One. Communicate openly and honestly point one of the biggest criticisms is the lack of open communication. Harry and Meghan's public airing of grievances has sparked controversy, but the real issue is a lack of honest communication within the family. For any family, open dialogue can help resolve tension before it gets out of control. 2. Set boundaries, but with compassion. Harry and Meghan's decision to leave the royal family was a bold move. They chose their happiness over the monarchy's expectations. Setting boundaries is key in any family, but it should be done